Welcome back to my channel. Hello guys, this is Brenda and today I will teach you how to make a JPEG, a thumbnail or a picture file which is good for your YouTube videos. So it will serve as your cover for your YouTube videos. And I will use this Adobe Photoshop CS3 Portable. And what's good on this app is that you don't need to install this on your PC. You just need to copy this and then you can click it, you can open it and you can work on that. So now let's start. This is the Adobe Photoshop CS3 Portable. All right. You can just click it, double click. And then say yes, click yes, and then just wait for it. It's opening. All right, so we're here now. These are the tools that you can use for editing photos. Click file. Click new. All right, so, so this is the exact size of the YouTube thumbnail. Okay, just remember this size. So it's pixels. All right, click or choose pixels. And yeah, that's it. All right. 1280 and then 720. All right. And this is your thumbnail or picture file for your J for your YouTube video. Okay, so this is the right size for it. So we will put a picture, right? Click file again. File. Open. So I will open a picture. For example, this. All right. Okay. So I choose now this picture. I will going to move this to this one to the right size. All right. So you will going to use this tool. Move tool. Click it. See this is move tool. Click the arrow, and then go back to the picture. Okay, you're going to this drag, drag. Hold it like you hold the mouse. We drag it to the. Okay. To the to your uh, thumbnail size so it's there now and let's go back to your picture let's close it because we already have it we moved it already we copied that all right click the magnifying glass and then here you see this it's zoom out and zoom in so i want to zoom out and then click it there in the picture so yeah it gets smaller right so you can work on it better change it I'm gonna make it smaller or in the right size click edit and then click free transform see right you can you can work on it you can make it smaller you can you whatever you want whatever whatever size you want right okay so yeah and then click enter upper left corner click image adjustment yes you can play on this tools or your settings okay File again, add uh, image adjustment. This way, for example, I'm gonna choose bright or contrast. Okay, I'm gonna make it uh, you can choose, uh, you can play on it like this way. See, so I want it that way, and then okay, and then click image adjustment. Also, choose color balance. If you think you like this one or this or this you can choose you can play on these tools and settings okay yeah okay yellow yes i want it that way okay you and saturation let's see that let's see it changes right so you can play on this, whatever you want. It's up to you, it's your choice. These are the options that you can do. Okay, okay. Or you can choose, I will choose horizontal. And then you can draw here a text box. So you can write something. Okay. Like I will say, logs of, right? Change the font style. You can change it here. Look, you can choose from here. For example, I will. I like this one. All right. All right. 
it, so I have it here now. Now, so. One eighty. I want it now. It's here. All right. Click move, and you can move it anywhere. Just drag it anywhere you want. All right. Okay. By the way, guys, these are the layers. Okay. See how the layers work. When you click this eyes, it's gone. Right? You can hide it or unhide it. Now I want another text to type. Again, letter T, then T, and then make a text box. And then you can write something again. So I want to type teacher. Yeah, I want to change the color. Highlight, click the color here, change it to purple. I want to make it purple. So you can choose what shade you like. Alright. It's here now. Okay, click move tool. And then, now, I want to do something on the letter. I want to make it like it's more bold. You can click the layer, teacher Brenda. Right click, click blending options and then you can choose from this or you can play in this see change something right when you click it drop inner outer satin color overlay gradient i want this stroke i want color black all right and then you can change how much is it this or this all right maybe i'll choose four okay and then click okay and then so you make a simple picture with a title or name or text so i have blogs of teacher brenda now i'm gonna save it you can save it like a, uh, an Adobe file, like click file, and then save. You can save it that way. For example, you say template. 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 Template one. Thumb nail. Alright. Say PSD. Photoshop, it means a Photoshop file. You can click it this way so you can edit it whenever you want. So you can go back on this file again if you want to edit something. Alright. PSD or Photoshop Adobe Photoshop PSD file. Then go and save it to desktop. Okay. And next. Save it as a JPEG file. File. Save us. And choose here instead of PSD, click JPEG. See JPEG. JPEG it means picture file. So you have uh, PSD or Photoshop file, and you have JPEG file. So whatever you want to do or edit, you can go back again. That's why you can save it. You have to save it as a PSD file. Click save. Just click OK, and then yeah, it's finished. All right now, let's see. So this is what we what we did. This is the template in PSD file. And then template this is the picture file jpeg file that you can see -da -da. you have a jpeg file for a thumbnail okay now let's use it okay this is my video my youtube channel let's click change see it represents your video see it's a perfect size now click save And that's it so that's it it's finished right see it's just super easy to do it it's just a simple simple editing for a picture and a simple typing all right okay so thank you for watching so that will be all for today's video i hope you learned something from that video it was just simple steps on making a jpeg or a thumbnail share for your youtube video so if you guys would like more videos of of editing of pictures and videos you can uh, you can write it in a comment section below so i can work on it and if you really like this video just click like thumbs up 
You can also subscribe in the channel. Just click subscribe and also click the bell button. So that would be all. Have a great time. Goodbye and stay safe. Bye. Mm -hmm.